Hello everybody! In this video I'm going to show you how to fix this error when booting a Windows operating system. Hello friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you will be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. If you encounter such error when starting or rebooting your computer and the operating system won't start, there can be several things to cause this problem. Usually this bug strikes computers with Windows 10, 8 and 7. Well, there can be several things to cause the trouble. Windows boot sequence can be reset if someone tried to reset BIOS or the BIOS battery is low. Other possible causes include damaged boot sector or incorrect work of the hard disk. The first thing to do is to check boot priority in BIOS. You can watch how to enter BIOS or UFI in one of our videos, find the link in the description. Now find the section with the name like boot sequence, boot device priority, set boot priority and so on. Your hard disk should be in the first position, and if it's not there, set the highest priority for the disk with the plus key. After that, press F10 and confirm your decision to save the settings. If you change the settings, but the error appears again, try another method. Use Startup Repair. For Windows 7 you will need a USB drive or a disk containing the installation package. You will have to boot from it and choose Startup Repair in the System Recovery options. In Windows 8 and 10 the error screen will give you a choice of advanced recovery options. When you select this item, you will have to run the Startup Repair utility. If this method doesn't work, try another one. This method involves checking the hard disk for errors and correcting them. To do it, open Advanced Options again and select Command Prompt. In the Command Prompt window, type the following command. It will check the hard disk for errors and fix them if possible. If, for some reason, you can't open the Advanced Options window, you will have to boot from a bootable drive. You can watch one of our videos to see how to create one. Find the link in the description as usual. Then press Shift plus F10 in any start screen to open the command prompt window where you can type this command. If you are not sure about the drive's integrity, run a proper scan with Victoria Utility to see its real condition. Visit our channel for a detailed video about it, and you can find the link in the description as always. If you've tried every method so far and you still see the error, and it indicates boot BCD, the problem must be in the damaged boot sector. Possible causes are numerous – viruses, system errors, power surges or hardware failures. Once again, you need the command prompt and some commands to type. Boot track fix boot. After this command is performed, restarting your computer is recommended. If it didn't help, type the following commands bootrack scan OS to rebuild the boot record. Bootrack rebuild BCD. As the last resort, when all the previous tricks didn't work, try the following bootrack.exe fix MBR. If this command fails too, there is nothing else left to do but to reinstall the operating system. But there is a special video about it, and you can find the link in the description as before. That is all for now. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching, and good luck!